A new Veterans Day celebration is set to take shape this year in Pass Christian. Tonight, Bill Snyder has more on an event aimed at honoring those who have served in the military. War Memorial Park in the past, it serves as a perfect backdrop to honor veterans. You see the banners under the street lights, you see the guns here and the monuments. They celebrate America, but also the veterans who fought and served for our country. And it will serve as the ending point for the first ever Gulf Coast Veterans Association Veterans Day Parade on November 11th. It'll be at 11 a.m. It'll start over by the railroad tracks, head through town and end here at the park. The organization Gulf Coast Veterans Association was formed back in uh, May. The Gulf Coast Veterans Association is a newly formed group led by vets like Moises Espanol. He's a two tour Marine that served in Afghanistan. So we created the organization with Again, one with the purpose of honoring these uh, heroes of the Gulf Coast and then two assisting veterans in needs. Our first major event is going to be this Veterans Day Parade that's going to be rolling down through downtown Pass Christian. With the parade, we're going to have dozens of vendors that are going to be set up across the lawn here, a live band, um, some food trucks and um, a lot of uh, veterans. He and other Coast veterans are working on the legacy of vets and also bringing to light some of the struggles that they have. I think there is a lot of negative attention that's given to veterans, um, but it's also important to highlight the success stories, right? In fact, he says the day before the parade, they're going to have what's called a claims clinic with VA members to try and help those vets with claims and maybe get some of them on their feet. In the past, Bill Snyder, WLOX News Now.